am Princess Promise, your relationship coach. I am here to educate you, or rather to enlighten you, ladies and gentlemen, on so many reasons, wrong reasons why people get married. One of the reasons are, don't get married because of pity. Don't get married out of pity. Getting married out of pity has put to, brought so many people into a scenario where they never wished for themselves. It has brought them down emotionally and otherwise. It has made them to lose their self-confidence. Getting married out of pity can make you endure domestic violence. Out of pity, if I go, if I speak out, if I speak up, what will happen to this man? What will happen to this woman? If I speak up, he might die, she might die. That is a very wrong reason to get married. Getting married out of lust, you feel for each other, is another sad one. You are lusting after the person's endowment. As a woman, you are lusting after the guy's capability in bed. Time. There, is, there are times and seasons, just even as the Bible stated too, for everything. That endowment, that woman you saw today looking very beautiful, she has potential, she is endowed physically. She has big boobs, she has big butts. She is not going to remain like that tomorrow. So many things will change in the life of that woman. Age has so many things it takes out of our individual life. That man that is performing now, that is a bulldozer in bed, tomorrow he might not be like that. Have you thought of him getting afflicted? He can be diabetic in future. So many things can happen and he will no longer be able to perform like the machine he used to. What will be the story? You start going out to cheat. You start doing things you never wished for you to do in your marriage. My dear brothers and sisters, it is time we put it straight. It is time we change that. It is time you get married for the real reasons. It is time you get married because you love the person. It is time you get married because you persevere in marriage. You have patience. It is time to get married and know that you are to build each other. It is time to get married and know that you are not getting married to a 100% perfect person. You are getting married to make the imperfections in each other perfect. You are getting married on the bedrock of Christ, making Christ the bedrock of your home. You are getting married to the true definition of marriage, which is supposed to be love, understanding, Get married to your spouse out of love. Get married to the right choice. Get married to the person you will persevere with. The person you have patience with. The person that you can both talk to each other and understand. Get married out of friendship. A good relationship. Not for you to get married because she is beautiful. Because she, is, she has potentials. Because she can cook. What if she gets fall sick tomorrow? What if she falls sick tomorrow and she cannot be able to enter the kitchen or prepare meals herself? What becomes of the relationship? It's a good one. I think we're stopping here today. Thank you for listening and please do well to subscribe. When you subscribe, click on the notification button to get you updated whenever there is a new video. Thanks for watching and happy Independence Day. Love you.